So, one more part to go, and this next part is worth three marks. And what we've got to do is find the area of the cross section of the shape or of the shed ABCD in square meters to two decimal places. So, you might like to pause the video and come back when ready. Okay, welcome back. Let's see how you got on. D. So to find the area of the shed, what we've got to do is find the area of the sector ABC um, and add it to the area of the triangle CAD. So we start with the area of the triangle CAD and uh, the formula I'm going to use is a, often referred to as a half AB sine C. That is that if you know two sides of a triangle, we do, that's this side, AC, it's 2.12 meters, and the side AD, 1.86 meters. And if you know the included angle, which we do, which let's just write that in, um, in here. Make sure you use the unrounded version, otherwise you're going to have rounding error, errors in your calculation. That angle we found out earlier in part C is 0 0.9207, and so on, radians. I'll add a little C there, it saves me writing the word radians in. Okay, so we should have enough here to be able to work out the area of triangle CAD then. The area of triangle CAD, CAD equals half the product of the two sides, so that's half times 1.86 multiplied by 2.12 multiplied by the sine of the included angle, not 0.92, but we'll give the unrounded version, 0.9207, and so on. Okay. And uh, all we need to do now is just work this out. Make sure, though, that you're in radians mode, because we are doing the sine of an angle in radians, so it's very important to be in the right mode. Okay, so if you work that out, I make it that we get 1.5694 and so on square meters. Okay, I'm not going to round this up. The only rounding I'm going to be doing now is the very final answer. That's the area of the cross section ABCD. Okay, so uh, we're nearly there now. All that we've got to do is simply add this to the last answer that we had for the uh, area and uh, if we just scroll that back up we had the area of the sector BAC was 1.46 meters squares so all I've got to do then is say that the area of ABCD equals the answer of the sector which was let's just go back up Let's just put the unrounded answer in. That was 1.46068. And then add that to the unrounded answer here. 1.5694 and so on. Okay. And then equals underneath. Add that up on the calculator. And what do we get? I make it uh, 3.0301 and so on and giving that then to two decimal places comes out at 3.03 .03 meter squares to 2 dp and that's the end of question 8 and for that you if you got it right you should have got three marks so well done if you did.